fastball hit hard out of the right field. That's a base hit and heading toward that corner. Good start at first for Calhoun and Tony Beasley's going to wave him. He heads to the plate without a throw and it's a stand up triple for Nathaniel Lowe. I mean, not even close. That's going to do it for Logue. Nathaniel Lowe knocking him out of this game. A breaking pitch that did not get away. He wanted it away. Lowe hooks it in the corner, and Loriano's got a long way to run to get this baseball. And he had a little bit of a problem getting it out. He rushed a throw. You can see he really didn't get very much on it. Kind of amazing. That throw there, not even thinking about the runner at third when they had no chance of getting the runner at home. And this one is hit into deep center field. It is high. It is far. It is gone. Nathaniel Lowe once again home run number 21 and he does it left on left absolutely incredible the season continues for Nathaniel Lowe putting up these huge numbers uh, he just looks so relaxed and so calm at the plate and I'm sure that comes with all the extra batting practice he's taken the work he's done. Rare has been the day where he hasn't gotten one and he lifts this one out of the left field. That could be trouble. That one's gone. Lowe has homered in the eighth inning and it's a two run game. Nathaniel's 23rd home run of the year makes it a 5 3 ball game. Especially on the starting yeah. side there's a lot of questions there past Kevin Gosner. Lowe launches one deep out to right it is gone. Another home run and it's 7 to 6. Unbelievable. Did you, did you just go DJ Khaled on us? Another one. <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievable here of back to back games. There's a slider right in the middle of the plate. We continue to talk about what a mistake that is for opposing pitchers to give Nathaniel Lowe an opportunity to take a pass at a breaking ball or any off speed for that matter inside the strike zone. To the bottom of the 10th inning, Charlie Culberson pinch running for Jonah Heim. 7, 8, and 9, low. First pitch swinging, and Lowe has just won the game! A two-run shot! 6-5 Rangers, and they sweep the Angels at home! You instantly have a chance to walk it off because Nathaniel Lowe represents the winning run, and he doesn't wait around, jumps on a pitch, and hammers it. And what a series this was for the Rangers against the Angels. Oh, solid. At bats for the Rangers, where they're just grinding it out. That ball's hit well and down the line. Fair ball into the right field corner. Garver around third. Beasley waves him home. He'll score without a throw. RBI double for Nathaniel Lowe. Rangers have a six run lead in the fourth inning. You know, there's been so many at bats tonight where, whether it's Otani or Moran, they've made some good pitches early in the count. Foster with a couple of checks and now the pitch. And Lowe shoots that one into left field. That's a base hit. Culberson will score easily from second. For Nathaniel Lowe is second of the day. And for the first time, the Rangers have a lead in this game. 8-7 in the 10. That was just a matter of time as they continue to creep back into this ball game. Nathaniel Lowe just, just got to love this approach right here. Not trying to do too much. He knows that a base hit's going to get the job done. He shoots his ball right down the left field line for an easy stand up double and Charlie Culberson comes around to score the go ahead run. The low fouls it off and so he'll get another 3 2 pitch Marcus Simeon at second Corey Seager at first and here it is and this one is lifted in the air shallow right field Pollock coming over he is not going to get to it and Marcus Simeon is around third he will score easily. And the Rangers are on the board. An RBI single didn't have to hit it hard. He hit it in the right spot. And the Rangers now trail at three to one. I mean, that's just putting together a great at bat right there. Like I said, you keep fouling off pitches or not swinging at pitches you're not supposed to swing at. You're eventually going to get something to hit. You would think that if this is a fastball or maybe if that changeup is misplaced on top of the bag, but nevertheless, back in scoring position. Ooh, this one in the air left field Haggerty angling back leaps it's over his head bounces up over the wall it's a buck rule double for low the Rangers add another run and it's five to three first pitch from Elias this one is hit hard out to right field out toward the bullpen gone 
gone. And a rifle shot by Nathaniel Lowe. Off the bat, you say there's a double pitch on the inside part of the plate. And boy, did he turn on that one. That ball just took off and shot into the Ranger bullpen. That didn't take long. This ball hammered deep out to center. That one is gone. A two run shot for Nathaniel Lowe. And the Rangers strike first this afternoon. Number 10 for Lowe. Well, right on time talking about the slug that the Rangers need in this lineup. And Nathaniel Lowe gets a hold of a fastball, but a missed spot by Josiah Gray. And Nathaniel Lowe makes him pay. Here's a 2 1. And that's in the air, out to right field. Brown goes back to the wall. Gone! Well, the hot hitting, Nathaniel Lowe continues his torrid pace here in the month of August. Well, he put a swing on that. We're going to see his reaction after making contact. He knows immediately that this ball is going into the seats. A little hanging slider up out over the plate. He pauses. And breaks it down. Rerun home run off the bat of Nathaniel Lowe. You got to just love the sound of the crack of the bat. Right. Not, the, not the angle that he wants to be at. That's cool. Oh, this ball is belted. Deep out to right, it is gone! And Nathaniel Lowe answers in the eighth inning. He might have to DH again on Friday. What a day for Lowe. Five RBIs and his 20th home run of the year. And he makes it 12-4 to four Rangers.